Hey guys, welcome back to Floki's Models. Today we're going to be completing the majority of the construction on Tamiya's 148 scale P38 Lightning. We're starting off by using some VMS 5K Flexi uh, CA glue to install the nose weight in the front. This kit was very well uh, engineered, and this is really the only problem that I've run into, but it's easily fixed. My fix was just to slide in a couple toothpicks and leave them there until after the glue dried, and then after I took them out, it stayed in place. joining one of the bottom wing sections. This is a separate piece for the top wing. The flaps also slide in nicely. As well as the wing tips. The doors for the gun bay. And then the landing gear base that was completed in the last video are slid into place into the tail boom. Drilling some holes out to add wire to the radios. Gonna glue them all in place here first. Then using some fast setting CA glue, I'll add the wires to the radio. And after the CA glue is set up, I can start bending them into place.
I don't think it looks that bad. And then again, using the same fast setting CA glue, I glue the radios into place. Now to do a little bit of painting, first using Mr. Color Zinc Chromate. The canopy gets masked and then the inside color is uh, painted on. Next up is some Tamiya XF62 Olive Drab. All the paint is thinned with Mr. Leveling Thinner at a ratio of 1 to 1. Next color up is Tamiya X7 Red. I'll be using this color to paint the spinners. Then I switch over to Tamiya XF1 Flat Black. And both props get painted with this color. The props then get a coat of Alkali 2 aluminum. And after the paint is set up, I use some hairspray and give them a good layer of that. Then they get airbrushed a final coat of XF1 flat black. After it's all dry, I'll take some tap water and an old brush and start reactivating the hairspray underneath to chip the black paint off of the aluminum. Not totally happy with the results, but it looks a lot better after all the decals and the tips are painted yellow. And now we're going to add the grill decals since we won't be able to get them later. And add the outside of the air intakes. Using Micro Crystal Clear, I attached the armored glass and gun sight to the front windscreen. Now I can start adding the canopy to the fuselage and getting closer to painting. Guys, thank you so much for watching. I know we really didn't get much done in this video. In the next one, it's all going to be about painting and weathering. So I hope you guys come back and watch that. I'd also like to know what kind of videos you guys like. 
Do you like my builds broken down like this, where, you know, it's several videos, or would you guys rather have just one long video from the beginning of the build to the end? Uh, just go ahead and let me know down in the comments what, uh, what you guys like, or what you want to see. And again, thank you so much for watching, and please, you know, like and subscribe if you haven't, and stay tuned for many more builds to come.